Hi, I'm ranked 10 in the world at LeetCode and have solved all the problems. In this video, I will give my thoughts on how to start LeetCode for beginners. I'm new to LeetCode. What language do I use? I would 100% recommend Python. I solved my first thousand problems on LeetCode using C++ and then switched to Python and never looked back. Python has much shorter syntax, a lot of great syntactic sugar, no types, and powerful libraries to leverage. Perhaps most importantly, you save so much time debugging. I can code up solutions in Python almost twice as fast as in C++ now. This means in a real interview, your code is less error prone and you will save valuable time on coding and can use that time to explain your thought process, which is the most important part. I'm new to coding and DSA. What course should I use? I recommend diving straight into the code and not using any course from the beginning. If you sort by acceptance rate, I'm sure that you can solve the easiest problems on the entire website. When you progress to more difficult problems, you will need to learn some theory and algorithm patterns. Here, I would recommend to pick it up as you go, on the fly. When you need BFS, DFS, Dijkstra's, etc. to solve a problem, that's when you learn it, not the other way around. After all, your goal is not to be a PhD researcher in algorithm theory. Your goal is to get good at LeetCode problems to land your dream job. There are over 3,000 problems to solve. How do I pick? I recommend using a list like Top3100 on Top3.com or LeetCode75. These will gradually progress in difficulty and will give you a wide exposure to the many different patterns you need to know for interviews. When am I interview ready? I would say everyone should have at least 100 problems solved as a bare minimum and should be able to solve around 80% of mediums comfortably, especially for new mediums you've never seen before. Obviously, I've spent way more time than this, but there is definitely diminishing returns at some point. However, I enjoy every second of leak coding, so I don't care about diminishing returns. Is leak code free? Yes. Leco Premium costs money, but you don't need it, especially as a beginner. I'm stuck on a problem. What should I do? Contrary to proper advice, I would recommend looking at the solutions after only 10 minutes of new, no new ideas. Oftentimes for beginners, it's not that you're too stupid to solve the problem. You just aren't exposed to the way of thinking or to the patterns needed to solve the problem. Learn them, then implement the solutions from scratch without looking at the solution. I've been leak coding without much improvement and want to give up. It took me almost four years of leak coding to get to where I am today. When I first started, I also gave up because it was so frustrating to not be able to solve easy problems. You need to dedicate yourself to leak code for many years to be an expert, like anything else. Remember the 10,000 hours rule. No one gets good overnight. Focus on why you started leak code in the first place and use that as motivation to push through the periods of stagnation. Thanks for watching and subscribe for more.